Hello. How are you today? I'm doing all right. How are you? Thankfully well. Good. So I want to wish you a sweet and healthy new year. Thank you. Same to you. Do you have big plans? <laughs> Actually, it's um, after having had to stay home for quite a while during COVID and all of that, just to be able to um, to wait for an elective surgery. And then, so the bottom line is no, I'm going to go a little bit to the synagogue, which is a big step for me to be out and actually in synagogue, but um, quiet this year. How about you? One step at a time, right? Exactly. Exactly. Yeah, you know, we we're for the first time having, um, since COVID, having some people with us. We used to have a big open house after for lunch first day, right. 40, 50 people. And wow. the past couple of years, we've had two other families spaced out on our deck. Um, so this is the first year we're having about 24 people, hopefully still be able to be outside. We've got very <laughs> cool here. Um, but family wise, it's a small, we're small amount. Kids are spread out, family spread out. So be good to be with people again. Yes. Hi, Marsha. Hi, Irina. Hi, how are you? Talking about holidays, it's always great. Yes. I wish you could smell my house. My husband has been baking all morning. So my house smells like oh, wow. uh, challah and apple cake. And it is, oh. So, so good. <laughs> wonderful. Unfortunately, I cannot bake at all, but I love bake <laughs> big <Bake> goods. <laughs> you like to eat it, right? I love it, yeah, but I'm not adventurous yet. But maybe you'll get there, Irina. You'll I I know. you are, you have courage. <laughs> when I met my husband, interest. <laughs> when I met my husband, I could make one dish, cashew chicken. And it oh. took about two hours to cut everything up for me. I was, and if not, if you came more than once, you got lean cuisine, or you might get spaghetti with a jar of sauce. And we got married, and he taught me how to cook. He's a much better baker. That's his thing. Um, wow. I inadvertently leave something out or forget to double something, or, but he's taught me everything I know. Well, that's wonderful. At least he know that he'll eat food that he likes. <laughs> we won't starve that is for sure yes, and you? She ate those too. So i hope we have everyone coming some people said they didn't think that Perfect. one person thought we weren't having class today i'm not sure why I oh i see two marshes <laughs> thank you go in a few minutes okay i i just spoke to carrie what i just spoke to carrie she knows you're coming so, um, so we'll give it another minute or two. Sorry about that. I'm, That's quite all right. I Husband. am taking care of <laughs> last minute stuff for the high holidays because I'm co-chair of the high holiday committee amongst a ton of other stuff. Um, I just yeah. want to... I just wanted to let you know, Debbie, um, I'm not sure Karen Glazer will be on today. Okay. Least being her husband had been in the hospital and he, yeah, long, long story. Um, he was in rehab. He's supposed to be discharged <laughs> today. So, yeah, but you know what that means could be any time today. Right. Exactly. So she, I spoke, she's a good friend of mine. I spoke to her this morning. I told her I would tell you in the event that she's not on. It's not that she's given up. She's elsewhere, literally. Well, we're going to wait another minute. I don't want to take up too much of our class time. I don't, I, when we talked la, uh, two classes ago, the first day we talked about what days would we be off? But I, today was never a day where we said we wouldn't have class, so I'm not no, sure. Not Maybe much. women are busy prepping for the holiday. So, um, 
I will let you know that we are not going to have class on October 14th because I'm out of town. And then we will not have class on November 11th, Veterans Day. Just so you know. Okay. Um, but we should have class unless for every other Friday that we have, unless something comes up. What about the Friday after Thanksgiving? Uh, no, you, that is another one. Thank you. We will not Hi, be everybody. meeting. Hi, Mary. That would be the 25th. Yes. We will not meet on the 25th. Okay. Um, yes, and I didn't even have that in there because I figured everybody will be busy either with a turkey coma <laughs> or <laughs> un unindated with dishes. Um, or clean so, up. Yes, digging out from turkey, 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 or unless those of you who are vegetarian. Sherry, welcome. It's very Thank nice you. to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. Sherry, tell us where you hail from. Cupertino, California, down the street from Apple. Ah, nice. Well, we're glad you're here. Is there and, anybody else um, from California or everybody's East Coast? No, Nancy's from California. Hi, Sherry. I'm in Sac the Sacramento area. Ah, Solano County. You're Solano County. I'm Sacramento County. No, I'm. We're not. But I. You're. Never mind. I thought maybe you belong to the Hadassah. No. Oh, Sacramento Mosaic Law Congregation. Mm -hmm. No, I belong you. to Saratoga. I'm familiar with that. Beth David. Yeah. Oh, oh. my husband grew up at Beth David. <clears throat> really? Who's Small his parents? Island. Hamilton Lempert. His parents are Joy and Dennis Lempert. Don't know. Them. They haven't been there for a long, long time. Mm -hmm. But that's where he grew up. Mm -hmm. So we will get started. If you um, have to miss a class, just so you know, they are recorded. And I want to go through real quick and show you how you can find those recordings. Um, and if you don't have an account, you will need to make one, but you should as members of Women's League. So you're going to, going to go on to WLCJ.org. It's the Women's League um, uh, website. And you're going to log in because this site, anything that you don't see on the, you know, up here at the top would be only for members. I'm going to go to log in and it's going to ask for your email address and password, um, which you, if you don't have it, you can hit forgot or reset password. And my screen is going to look a little different than yours because I'm a consultant. But member materials is where you're going to go. This is where it'll look a little bit different. And you're going to go to Hebrew classes. And we are fall semester 2022. <coughs> and we are intermediate. <coughs> And you'll look for Debbie Lempert's class. <coughs> and then here's the recording so far. And you click on them. Hopefully more people. And there's the YouTube channel. So any particular questions about that that I can answer? Well, that was very helpful. Thanks very for helpful. Okay. Thank you. Great. Um, so I'm glad you're all here today. Thank you for taking the time amongst your busy schedules. So I believe 
We ended last week. We did Matovu and Birchot Tashahar. And we started talking a little bit about Baruch She'emar. And um, I just want to review because we have um, maybe some people on who weren't on last week. But when we say Baruch She'emar, we grab our two front seat seat, um, which not many people do. But I always wondered why. And it's because <clears throat> we say Baruch by itself 10 times, but you don't include the Baruch Hu, which meant is God. Um, and that corresponds to the 10 utterances which God used to create the world and the 10 commandments and the 10 attributes of God. So to remind us of this, we hold the two front seat seats since each one has five knots, which makes 10. So. I'm going to go ahead and share my screen. There's a whole lot on there today. And I'm going to put you all over here so I can. So if I'm looking to the side, it's because I'm looking at your lovely faces. All right. <clears throat> I see Eric B, but that's not Eric B. <clears throat> no, that's Sivian. Sivian, do you know how to change the name? No, and I don't. I had difficulty getting on today altogether. I'm sorry. I'm going to change your name for you. Okay. Oh, actually, I'm going to tell you how to do it because we're here to learn. So, Sivian, in in your box at the top right, do you see three little dots? <clears throat> yes or no? Yes. Okay, click on those three dots. Yes, I did. Do you see somewhere it will say in that list rename? Uh, hmm. It does not. So nope. I'm supposed to go further. I don't know. I see. So chat. another op another hmm. option is to go to the bottom of your Zoom screen. And I can't do it now because I'm sharing my screen. Um, I will rename you for now, and then next time. Before I share the screen, make sure I spelled it right. Did I spell it right? Oh, I can't see where 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 would I find it? In your box. Next hey, your picture. Shout out. It's uh, may, double. May I just may I suggest another way? Sure. Uh, you may have you may have mentioned it in another way. If you go to the part to the little tab that says participants. Yes, I am not seeing that because I'm sharing my screen. Thank you. Okay, but if any of you go to the tab that says participants, we'll see there are nine of us. You click on the, and I'm on my iPad rather than a PC right now, but you go to participants, you'll see your name. Just click on your name. I'm clicking on mine and I can either mute or rename. Click rename and that's how you do it. Oh, okay. Well, I, just for point of information, you, I needed another N in my name. Got it. Well, thank well, you. you can do it. You can do it yourself. Just go into participants, your name, rename, and you can do whatever you need to do. Okay. How do we do this? Rename. Great. Okay. We learn something new every day. <laughs> we do. <laughs> That's the easiest way I've found to do it. Thanks. Perfect. Mary. Thank you so much. Sure. All right. So. <laughs> We're going to take turns since we are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight of us. <clears throat> one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And you we didn't know. already read this prayer last week, did we? No. Okay, I didn't think so. So what we'll do is we'll go through it a few times. Everybody will get at least one line and we'll go through it a few times. <clears throat> So, and if you look, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We don't count Baruch Hu because that's God's name. So there are, in fact, ten Baruchs. <clears throat> Is there somebody who would like to read the the Baruch Hu goes with the first line? Would someone like to read that? Thank you, Gail. Baruch She'amar Vehayam. What is it? Yeah. Good. Ha Olam Baruch Hu. Wonderful. Next line. Who would like Baruch to read? 
Thanks, Sivian. No, Bur Sherry. Go ahead. Oh, Sherry, go ahead. Bura. Ho. Hi, um. Take a look at that second word. That first letter is ayin. It has no sound, so it borrows its sound from the vowel next to it. O. Correct. You want me to keep going? Yes. After O. Uh, Baruch. Yosha. Careful, Baruch. that's a sin. Yosha. Oh, say good. Bara, I'm witten. She, sheet, bara sheet. Vare sheet. Vare sheet. Kind of like bara sheet, the Torah portion creation. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. Who would like to read the third line, the third sentence or phrase, I should say? Sivian, was that your hand? Yes. Baruch, Omer, Varose. Excellent. Next line. Thanks, Nancy. Baruch go zer umekayim. Great. And for the first two letters of that last word, um, I believe the U and the Mem go together. Um. Okay. Because um, there's a vowel. I'm not 100% sure, but, but I believe it's two vowels together. The first vowel gets the emphasis. Um, kayen. Okay. Um, kayen. Beautiful. Thank you. Next one. I'll do it. Thanks, I'll, Mary. Baruch. Miratem. All. Can you go back to that second word and read it again for us? <clears throat> sure. Miratem. That's the chet. <clears throat> oh, um, thank you. Mirachem. Yeah, you got to scratch your throat a little bit. Um, Can you I read the whole line it. again for us? Surely. Baruch, Mirachem, al acharet. Excellent. Next line. I'll do it if you want. Thank you, Rhoda. I'd love you to. <laughs> Thank you. Baruch Marachem Al Habriyot. Beautiful. How about the next line? <laughs> Don't be shy. Thanks, Arena. Baruch Hai Laad. But I work, go up one. <laughs> Oh, I'm in the wrong line. <laughs> you but, get the long one. <laughs> I, I, I vote for the shorter one, but <laughs> <laughs> you can do it. <laughs> Baruch Meshalem Sahar Tov Lirei Hav. Oh, Lirei Av. Beautiful. Has everybody had a turn? I should say, has everybody had a turn who wants one? Marsha, do you want to do the next one? I'm going to try. Baruch, Chai, La'ad, the Kaim, La Ach. All right, let's look at those last two words again. Can you read those last two again? Vikayam. Mm -hmm. La Ne, I said Ach. But you're going to tell me I should say ha, right? Actually, right. I'm not going to tell you to say either one of those because look uh, where the vowel is. <clears throat> what's uh? Sorry. Well, I don't know how to say it. I La, I did. Ne, and now that's a sadi. So give sadi the ah sound. Okay. La, ne, sach. There you go. You're trying to put the vowel under the chet, and that was confusing. It's just la net sach. Excellent. All right, here we go. We have two more lines. Who's going to do them? Do I have a taker for the second to last line? 
I don't. Okay. All right, Gail. All right, Baruch Pode Uma Seal. Excellent. And Arena, I gift you the last line, the shortest line. <laughs> Baruch Shemo. Excellent. Normally in my shul, we just say Baruch She'amar Vahaya Ha'olam Baruchu, and the rest is silent. But this is a really good um, prayer. I don't know how you do it in your shul, but um, I feel like it's really good because the Baruch repeats, so it's a little easier. Um, let's see, we have one, two, two, three, four. So how about if we do partners on this one? So. Two people volunteer, one reads the first line, one reads the second, and then you switch. <clears throat> that way you get to hear somebody else read the line that you're going to read next. <clears throat> I'm sorry. Wait. So one person will read the first line, somebody else will volunteer to read the second line, and then they'll flip flop. The second reads the first, and the first reads the second. And then we'll do two more volunteers. Do I have anyone who, so Marsha, will you read one? And who will be Marsha's partner? Is I that will. a hand up, Nancy? Yes. All right, Marsha, then Nancy, and then Flip. Baruch She'amar Vahaya Ha'olam. You can tack on that a little bit. <laughs> oh, Baruch Hu. No, Baruch Hu. Good job, Nancy. Okay, so I'm reading the third line, or effectively, yes. right? Yes, okay. be correct. So, the third line, second step, second right. phrase. Baruch Ose Vare Sheet. Excellent. Now, Nancy, will you go back up and read that first line? Sure. Baruch She'amar She'amar V'chaya Ha'olam. And the next little part? Ah, uh, yes, Baruch Hu. <laughs> Great. And uh, Marsha? Baruch Ose Vereshit. Excellent. Now we're going to go on to third and fourth. Do I have a volunteer to read three and one to read four? Thank you. Gail, will you do three? Do you have a Good helper pleasure. for Gail? I'll do four. Mary, Mary thank you. Okay. All right. Baruch. Omer the O Se Bora Zo Zoter. Look again, uh, real carefully. <clears throat> uh, is it Zoter? It's uh, a gimel at the beginning. Oh, I'm sorry. Go mare, go there. Go there. There you go. No, excuse me. Uh, um Kayim. Excellent. Will you flip flop? <clears throat> Shirley Baruch, Omer, the Osa. Baruch, go Gozer, Um Kayim. Excellent. Thank you, ladies. Thank do we have you. somebody to do the next two? I'll do one. Thanks, Sivian. Will somebody be Sivian's partner? I can do this. Thanks, Irina. Baruch Mara Cham Chaim Al Haaretz. Baruch Merahim Al Habri. What? Say it again. Hab Habri Yot. Oh, Excellent. Habriot. All right, flip flop it. Arena, you take the line above. Baruch Merahim Al Haaretz. Baruch Merahim Al Habriot. Beautiful. Habriot. Habriot. How about two more people who haven't had a turn? No, oh, you're some of you are being shy today. All right. Will someone partner with me on the next two? 
I will. I don't care. All right, Gail. Do you want? I'll go first. Sure. Baruch, Mishalem, Sachar, Tov, Lorei Av. Baruch, Chai, Laad, Ve, Kayam, Lane, Zach. Excellent. You want to go and do the one I just took? Okay. Baruch, Me, Shalem, Shahar, To. Careful. Careful. Go back to that word. It's not a chin. Sa, Har, To, Li, Re, Av. Baruch, Chai, Laad, Vekayam, La Netzach. All right, we have two left, two short ones. <clears throat> Any takers? <clears throat> you up for it, Rhoda? <clears throat> All right. All right, Sherry, will you try one? <clears throat> okay. Uh, Baruch, Poda, Umatsi, Matziel. Excellent. Sherry? Baruch. Shemo. Excellent. Flip flop. Baruch. Uh, sorry, my eyesight. Baruch. Poda. Umatsi. Matsil. Umatsil. Umatsil. Like our our Umatsil. All right. And Rhoda? Baruch Shemo. Nice job, ladies. No really tricky long multisyllabic words in that, but I realized that I did not open this up all the way. So I apologize if the whole um when I, I printed have, it, if you didn't. I have a question. The, yes. Um if you go the, the the fourth line from the bottom, the last word, would you please say how it is supposed to be spoken? Li, re, av. Okay, I didn't hear the. I, I, I want to verify that. that. That's fine. Thank you. Li, re, av. Yep, that's what have, I thought. I have a Thank question. you, Marcia. Is is there a tune to this? And if there is, Debbie, would you sing a couple lines of it? Because I can remember better if it has the tune. Um, like I said, we do it silently, but the beginning I, we sing in some places, Baruch She'amar Vahaya Ha'olam Baruch Hu. That's it. <laughs> I've never heard it sung out loud. But I don't know, for some reason, compared to all the other prayers in Pazuke, this seems to be a little bit of an easier one, not as many multi-syllabic words. So I appreciate that about this one. Um, would someone like to read it in English for us? Sure. Hopefully not as challenging. Thanks, Sherry. Blessed is the one who spoke and brought the world into existence. Blessed is God. Blessed is the one who maintains creation. Blessed is the one whose words are deeds, whose decrees are fulfillments. Blessed is the one who has compassion upon the world and all its creatures. Blessed is the one who re rewards those who are reverent. Blessed is the one who lives forever and endures through eternity. Blessed is the one who redeems and rescues. Blessed is God's name. Blessed is Adonai, our God, ruler of the universe, God, the merciful father, mother. You are praised by the world of your people, extolled and glorified by the words of your devout ones and servants, particularly by the words of your servant, David, with praises and songs. Sorry. With praises and songs shall we laud you, Adonai. We shall exalt you, praise you, and glorify your name, our God and King and Queen. O oh, unique one, life of the universe, praised and glorious King, Queen, your name is eternal. So I am thinking, based on what we have here, um, that either I don't have the whole prayer here. Um, let me look. Because yeah. that's a, oops, sorry. Every time I hit a chord, it goes out. It will come back. Um, 
that there's a lot more there in English than there is in Hebrew. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah. let me see what what is here. I apologize if I yeah something. because you stopped if blessed is God's name. Baruch Sh yeah, there's some missing, so I Baruch, apologize. Yeah. But okay. it's not in the book. It's not in the book either. No. It on mine. It is underneath. Um, after Baruch Shema, it's Baruch Atad and Ayelo Hainu Melacham Ha'el Ha'av Harachaman. Oh, um, okay. Gotcha. So I will add that in for next week. I apologize, um, but if you can, you can see when I we go back and look, um, we thank God in Moda Moda Ani. We tell God how wonderful God is in Matovu. We. Bless God in Birchot Shahar and Baruch Sha'amar, we bless God. So Shacharit is a whole lot of blessing, thanking, and praising God. <clears throat> That's much of the morning service, actually. Mm -hmm. um, so I will add that in and thank you because um, I didn't see that, the father and the mother and king, so I will fix that for mm -hmm. next time. Thank you. So any Debbie? Yes. Okay, so is did you make this in, uh, copy, if you will, from the complete Sim Shalom or from a different source? Um, from the Slim Sim Shalom. Slim Sim Shalom. Okay. So not from um, the one that has the has everything in it. Okay. It's just the weekday. Doesn't have Shabbat. If you have the complete one, it's on page fifty-four. Thank you. You're welcome. welcome. Can we Can move on? on? All right. Hallelujah. We have a lot of hallelujah prayers in Pazuke. So apparent from what I've been told, there were there were many, 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 many prayers. Um, and when the rabbis decided to break the service and make a formal service, um, they they didn't go through and say, ah, oh, we like this prayer better than this prayer. They just put all the prayers together and called it Pazuke de Zimra and Shahrit and Musaf. So it's a combination of many, many Psalms and not all synagogues do all Psalms. Some pick and choose which ones they want. So there's a lot of Psalms, a lot of hallelujahs. <clears throat> so this is Psalm 150. I'm gonna stop sharing for a moment so I can tell you about it. <clears throat> Once I find my trusty notes. <clears throat> All right. That's not the one I want. Yeah, some of the English is missing also on this prayer. Because when you, out, when you sent out the prayers originally, but not today showing them, the rest of the English is there. You're right. I did not have it. I just opened it up and there it is. Thank you. So you don't have the other part? <clears throat> well, I'll show you what it, here's what, uh, hold on a second. So I just opened it up for some reason, something happened in, so it didn't, ha it stopped here, but it goes down to the word hallelujah. Do you have that on your page? <clears throat> I do. Okay. I have it on the original page you sent us. Mm -hmm. Okay, good, I'm glad. Yeah. <clears throat> Thank you for pointing that out because sometimes it gets smushed up and I don't know how. Mm -hmm. Psalm 150 is a climactic conclusion of a collection of five Psalms. Psalms 146, 47, 48, 49, and 50, where everyone and everything are to praise God everywhere. This particular Psalm speaks of the ultimate end of a life that has encountered God. This final Psalm presents the basic questions and sets forth the biblical pattern of praise. It's the last of the chapter of the book of Psalms, serving as a kind of grand finale to a jam-packed book of poetry and praise. The word hallelujah is repeated 12 times in six verses. Hallelu shares the root with the word hallel, the prayer we recite on many holidays and was imported into English in the form of hallelujah. It means praise, but in the context of this prayer, it is an imperative as an instruction for all Israel, the people to 
praise God. There are lots of instruments and sounds in this palm psalm. Many people find music and singing to be spiritual. So we are implored <clears throat> to praise God uh, in this prayer. And um, we can look for it 12 times. <clears throat> Is this big enough or do you need me to? Um, no, it's fine. It's fine. Because okay. I can probably go just a little bit bigger. You need to move it over a teeny bit. Move it over a teeny bit. All right. So let's read it in English first <clears throat> so we know what we're singing. I don't think we're getting the full uh, text in Hebrew. No. Right. I'll right, move I'll it back, move back over. over. Okay. okay. All right. Would someone like to read the English? <clears throat> You haven't shared yet. Yes. Yes, she yeah, has. I'm sharing. No, she has. Yes, she did. It's yeah, on the screen. Up here. It's on the screen. It, Hello. I'll everybody. stop and try again. Maybe it didn't work for everybody. Hi, Debbie. I'm here now. Hi. I'm so glad you're with us. Let me <laughs> zoom it back down. Is that better? Yep. Yep. All right. For some reason, I'm not seeing anything. Hmm. Um, are you in? Are you in Zoom? Are you on your Zoom screen? Yeah. I have Tell no me what you are seeing. Technology. It's just not doing anything, and I'm full. My, my, our our web is fine here. What are you seeing? Full powder. Oh. I'm using an iPad right now. No, but tell me what you see on your screen. I see Debbie Lampert has started screen sharing and it's going round and round and round and round. Oh, because your internet connection is having some trouble. That's nope. why. <clears throat> that's nope. usually what that means. If it's spinning, it means it's loading. <clears throat> Look, I'm, by the way, I'm on an iPad. It's Mary. I'm on an iPad also and it's fine. So there must be okay. something in your Zoom or your connection. I've had that happen. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, my, luckily, it looks I, like I have all the bars and my web is fine. I mean, I've got all the. Luckily, I see you're holding the packet. Do you have the prayer in front of you? Yeah. Good. I'm so glad you can see at least one of the prayers. <clears throat> Would someone like to read Psalm 50 for us? Sure, I will. Thank uh, you. Ha hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise God in God's sanctuary. Praise God in God's awesome heaven. Praise God for God's might uh, deeds, for God's infinite greatness. Praise God with trumpet calls, with harp and linger. Praise God with drum and dance, with flute and strings. Praise God with clashing cymbals, with resounding cymbals to sing praises. Let every breath of life praise God. Hallelujah. Wonderful. So you can see the instruments. You can hear them you can visualize them <clears throat> and every line does have two um up, up through up until past the square there are two hallelujahs in every line we've got one um one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven and i guess they're counting hallelujah is twelve <clears throat> Actually, how about at the bar? How about at the line with the square? Oh, yeah. okay, there it is. So I thought I had that. Um, so lots of praising God. Um, so we're going to start with this one, and we'll do the same thing. We'll do partners, two people read and flip flop until everybody's had a chance. <clears throat> Would anybody like to start the first line? Hallelujah. <laughs> Good job, Sherry. Sherry, yes. will you take the next one? Uh, yeah. Can somebody be Sherry's partner? Hallelujah. Al Bahar Rosh. All right, let's stop you right there, Sherry. You weren't here for the first two classes. I'm going to give, we're going to fill you in on a secret. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Look under that coof. Do you see yeah. it looks like a line and a dot? Yep. 
We always think of that as a kamat, but look real carefully. The dot and the line aren't connected. Yep. That's a secret symbol that we don't read it as ah, but we read it as o. Ben so od Bakadosh. Bakadosh, yes. Hala. Well, it's it's be ko, code show. Be code mm. show. It does look like kadosh. You're right. Um, how la hallelujah? Who? Mm hmm. Ba baha baha. Take a yeah. look. Take a look under bet. What vowel is there? Yeah. B. B. Racha. Put them uh, together. B and the Rash. Barri. Just Bri. Bri. Sorry, B. Beer. Like what beer. you drink, the beer. Yep. Cod. Cod. Yo. Beer. P A ah. B beer beer he ha ah. okay beer to ah. good uh yeats yeats careful that's an ayin it only has it has no sound so it takes the vowel below it what is that vowel is is ah Ooh. Uh, just oo. Ooze. Ooze. Okay. Ooze. Oh. So we have a lot of alcohol in this line. We've got beer <laughs> and ouzo. <laughs> we must have been and having mixed, some good drinks. And a mix of God. cultures. <laughs> and a mix of cultures. Very true. Thank you, Sherry. Do we have somebody who will read the second line and then flip flop with Sherry? I will. Thanks, Gail. Okay. Hallelujah. Big burrito. Careful to check out the vowel above Raish. Row. Beer. Burrito. Hallelujah. He rose. School. Good love. Excellent. Taking it letter and sound by letter and sound all the way through is how we have to do some of these longer multisyllabic words. Good. Ladies, will you flip flop? Sure. Halle, hallelujah. Hallelujah. The code show. Hallelujah, beer, kia, kia, uz, uz, uzo. Good job. I'm tasting that. I have some uzo in my kitchen. Look. <laughs> Unless you like black licorice, if you like black licorice, uzo is for you. All right, Sherry, would you like to take the second line? I did the second line. I, no, I didn't do this next. I didn't do the third line. All right, the third line. Yeah. Hallelujah. Oh. Hallelujah. Uh, uh, it's easier to look at my thing. Um, uh, being. Um, Sorry. Be You got the first part. Big vu. Look at the vowel over rage. Big vu. Re. It's up above, so it makes the O sound. O ta. Big vu ro tav. Uh, hallelujah. Ooh. Um, Kareb. Same thing. 
Look at the little dot above the ratio. It's another O. Karov, Karga, Gadala. Oh, check the check out the vowel under Gimel. Eh, get goo. It's goo. Ga, goo, the low. Good low. Good job. I have. Thank you, lady. Yes, Serena. Um, the second word in the third line, or second line. Uh, I understand it's a V, not B. You said B. Oh, you're right. Vig Vurotov. You know what? I've always said Vig Vurotov. You are correct. Yes. Notice there's no, I always say bet this the bet doesn't have a belly button. It got vacuumed out, so it's a vet. Vig Vurotov. Thank you, Arena. You caught us. <clears throat> All right. Can, do, can we have a volunteer for complete line three and four? Two partners. Nancy, who will partner with Nancy? <clears throat> Thanks, Karen. I'm glad you're here. <laughs> All right, start us off, Nancy. Okay. How, hallelujah. Who? Bete ka. Shofar. Mm hmm. Hallelujah. Bene vel. Vicky. Nor. Good. Just check out that last word. There's no dot in cough. He lost his cough drop, so his throat oh. is scratchy. Oh, Vicky. Yes. Nor. Vicky Nor. Yep. Yeah. All right. Um, Karen? Halu, halu, ho, hal, hal, halu, hu. Yeah. Bitok. What's that ending? Look at that ending letter and that second oh, word. Bitof. There you go. Um, hal. One more time. That third word. Uma, uma, hal. Good job. Halu who? Halle. Halle. Oh, Halle Lu who? But it's actually, sorry, I'm, I'm wrong. Halle Lu who? Halle who? Hal goes together. Hal. Halle Lu who? The me name of the the O Gav. The O Gav. Excellent. It's tricky, isn't it? Lots of, lots of syllables. Ladies, will you flip? Of oh, hal haluhu, no haluhu. Bete bete ka show far show far haluhu bene bene vel. The the key. Careful, it's not a cough, it's a chaf. The he nor. Excellent. Flip it. Hall Who was reading? Okay. Hallelujah. Who? Betof. Uma. Hol. Hallelujah. Who? Benim the U Gav. Beautiful ladies. It's not easy stuff. <clears throat> All right, we have three more lines, but the last two lines are repeats. So we really only have two lines. Do I have a taker for the last set? I'll do. Thank you, Arena. Who will be Arena's partner? I will partner. Thank you, Sivian. You want to go first, Arena? Sure. Haliluhu. Vetsil Tselei. Shama. Good job. Oh, Sham. You're right, Shama. Oh, Shama. Haliluhu. 
Betsil Betsil Teru A. Nice job. All right, Sivian. Oh, Hani Shama. It's actually Han. just Han because the Han. two vowels. Han Shama. Uh, Han Shama. Ta Hal Lay. Ya. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. No, ha. Hallelujah. Yeah. Good job. And when we. Um, so it's Tehalel. There's two lamets. Tehalel, ya, hallelujah. Great. Would you ladies flip? Sivian, will you take the box line? Hallelujah. But seal, salay, shama, hallelujah. But seal, lay, Torah, Tarua, Tarua. Good. And Arena? Um, kill. Han Shama. Tehalel. Ya. Hallelujah. Wonderful. I have a um, question. Yeah. A question. Um, in this the second last word in the prior line, this is B seal lay or B seal a lay. This is schwa, second schwa, it sounds so um, it's that seal to lay. Oh, so they seal. all get their so lamid doesn't get its own vowel, but it's be seal sa. Yeah. Lay because two okay. schwas in a row, but okay. this, yeah, but sealed salay trua. I hear a little Rosh Hashanah in here. I heard shofar, trua, uh, very appropriate for this. And then here is halal, there's halal in there, praise. Thank you. So in services at my shul, we usually start off hallelujah, hallelujah, bekocho, but I bet you many of you have heard it sung starting at the box. Does anybody know this tune, a tune for this? Hallelujah, hallelujah, vitzil tzalei shama. Hallelujah, hallelujah, vitzil tzalei trua. Kohan shema te hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Kohan shema te hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Very Anybody nice heard that before? No, yes. But very, yes, but it's very pretty. Yeah, Thank you. I, I, have a, I have a question. Thank you so much, Debbie. Sure. I've always wondered, ever since I was a kid, you, as you noted, there's a little box there where in your show you start. Who decided 100 years ago or a zillion years ago, if you want to do the abbreviated version where you start? You know, there's so many different prayers where we tend to, we, we stop at a certain paragraph and start somewhere else. How was that decided? I have no idea, but I can bet you a woman had nothing to do with it. Probably so. <laughs> but thank you. I just, it's just I, one of those things that I've always wondered. There's another tune we do um, that goes like this. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. It's the last line. Kohan Shema, Te Hallelujah, Hallelujah, Kohan Shema, Te Hallelujah, Hallelujah, Hallelujah. We sing that when the Torah goes around. Um, so it's a fun one. So thank you. I think you're welcome. So often these are said silently, but it's good for us to practice, you know, just instead of practicing just the first word and the box to the end, we're practicing our Hebrew. So the next prayer is 
again, one we do in uh, mostly silently, but there is some, there are some synagogues that sing this prayer, at least the first uh, few stanzas. So we're going to, we won't go all the way through it. We'll go up to, um, my synagogue doesn't sing this at all, but when I went to a women's league convention, I was told, oh no, we sing it up through a certain point. So we will sing uh, um, we will work on probably up into Oy, Oyev, so that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, like through Oyev. <clears throat> so we'll work a little bit on it. I'm not sure if you've heard it. Az Yeshir Moshe Uvene Yisrael et Et Hashira Hazot, Ladonai Vayom Rule more. And later on, you'll see that there's Micha um, Mocha in here. So it's a very beautiful song when my shul just doesn't, my rabbi sings a little of it, but it's a beautiful prayer. And um, I noticed, Debbie, that it has the trope marks underneath it. Ah. Yeah, but that is not the tune I was singing. <laughs> no, but I'm I'm just saying that you yes, know it does. I mean, it does. And um, if that isn't so, confusing, yeah. Well, if you know trope and you want to sing it to trope, no, no, no. I, but I'm just saying, you know, for those yeah. of us that are doing it sim syllable by syllable or letter by letter, sometimes the trope marks and get in the way. That is for sure. Work. Mm -hmm. That is for sure. So we're going to stop there today. I did want to let those of you who uh, weren't in on the very beginning that there are three days we will not be meeting. And those three days are October 14th, because I already had plans to meet my child in Cleveland. It's about a four hour drive. We will not meet on Veterans Day on Friday, November 11th, and we will not meet on Friday, November 25th, because we'll all be either too sleepy or have family in town. So um, we will not meet on those days, but we will be here all other Fridays, 1.30, same time, same Zoom station. <laughs> Any questions, comments? Rhoda? But you have to unmute so we can hear you. You're muted. It's the story of Zoom life. <laughs> I, I just don't want you to hear extra noise. That's all. Um, did you send out uh, any mailing this week? With what I did you were not. I apologize. Oh, I, okay. had, I just wanted to make sure I didn't miss something. That's all. No, I've had Rosh Hashanah on the brain. I'm in charge of, of family service, so I apologize. But you no did problem. ask, and I thank you for checking in. We will be here next week. Maybe a little bit, not as light as we were this week. I'm just thinking of all the f cooking that's coming and all the eating that's coming. So any other questions, comments, or concerns? No, it's been very nice. Everybody. Thank you very much. Shabbat Shalom and Lashana Tova. Lashana Tova. Lashana Tova. I, I guess we can say Happy we'll year, see you everybody. next year. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> I hope Literally. it is a happy and a healthy one. Absolutely. Healthy, healthy, healthy. and healthy. And Definitely sweet. healthy. That's and the sweet. most important. And sweet. Mm -hmm. yeah. And cool. I don't know what it's like by you, but our temperature dropped from 90 to about 66 overnight. Wow. Well, so in New York, it, it went down 20 degrees, yeah. Yep. Mother Probably nature. even cooler, I think. <laughs> Where are you, Debbie? Cincinnati, Ohio. Oh, how nice. So, you know, my I guess Mother Nature knows Rosh Hashanah is upon us. So <laughs> enjoy Shabbat Shalom. Have a great week. Thank you very Hello. much, Debbie. Bye. 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 Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.